there exists a great unseen stream of power, which may be compared to a river, except one side flows in one direction, carrying all who get into that side of the stream onward and upward to wealth. Again, the other side flows in the opposite direction, carrying all who are unfortunate enough to get into it and not able to extricate themselves from it, downward to misery and poverty. Every person who has accumulated a great fortune has recognized the existence of this stream of power in life. It consists of one's thinking process. The positive emotions of thought form the side of the stream which carries one to fortune. The negative emotions form the side which carries one down to poverty. If you are on the side of the stream of power which leads to poverty, this may serve as an oar by which you can propel yourself over into the other side of the stream. It can serve you only through application and use. Merely reading and passing judgment on it, either one way or another, will in no way benefit you. You got to do it. When riches take the place of poverty, the change is usually brought about through well-conceived and carefully executed plans. Poverty needs no plan. It needs no one to aid it because it is bold and ruthless. Riches are shy and timid. They have to be attractive. First they ignore you. Then they laugh at you. Then they fight you. Then you win. Check us out at ProctorGallagherInstitute.com for tips, tools, and resources.